everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathleen and today's video we are going to be opening up my Owlcrate box for the month of October. This is a young adult book subscription box and it is $29.99 for a box per month plus shipping. It contains a newly released YA book as well as about four or five little bookish items. Every month they do have a theme and the theme for the month of October is Dawn of a New World and I'm so excited for this box because the theme sounds really really cool. Yeah so let's go ahead and open it up and see what we got. Alright so opening up the box at the very top we do have the Owlcrate crate card they are always so nicely designed on the back it just tells you everything you need to know about the items in the box so the first thing that i see is something that they said that they were going to include this month it was one of their spoilers that they uh, announced on their social media and the item is a tin box and it says until the last star in the galaxy dies you have me Jay Kristoff and Amy Kaufman and then on the back it says live a life worth dying for Jay Kristoff and Amy Kaufman so this is a book 10 and it is inspired by Illuminae which is one of my favorite favorite series of all time I love that series and as you can see it's just a little book 10 it's very very pretty all right and then the next item in the box is in this little box right here I by the sound it sounds like it's jewelry I'm really excited because I feel like it's been a while since we've gotten a piece of jewelry from Owl Crate uh, I could be wrong I don't remember though oh wow that is so pretty I absolutely love that so according to the Owl Crate card, it says celebrate your love for the Lunar Chronicles with this gorgeous yet subtle pendant necklace inspired by the series. This is an Owl Crate exclusive and was designed with love by Iron and Ink Designs. That is so, so pretty. Probably my favorite jewelry that we've gotten from Owl Crate. This is so pretty. I'm going to use this a lot. Not only because I love the series, but because I think that is adorable. That is just so gorgeous. All right. And then the next items in the box. Oh, okay. So these are the monthly enamel pins. And this month we get two of them. And one is a heart. And another looks like a radio with some headphones. Very pretty. I really like these. And then the next item that I see. Oh! They're magnetic bookmarks from Crafted Band and by the design it looks like they are saga inspired. The saga as in the graphic novel which I absolutely love. It's one of my favorite graphic series of all time and I absolutely love these. And then the next thing that we got in the box is a sticker and this one says everything science fiction until someone makes it science fact. And this is a quote by Marie Lou from Warcross. All right, this month in the box, they did include two different books. So the first book that we got is called I Hope You Get This Message by Farah Naz Rishi. Apologize if I'm mispronouncing the last name. This is also an exclusive signed edition and it is absolutely gorgeous. It looks like we also get a signed letter from the author and I really, really like this cover. I'm really into the neon green of this cover and according to the Owl Crate card, it says, experience a society thrown into chaos as it's revealed that an alien planet may end life as we know it in just seven days. A dean, a coder, and a radio enthusiast wants to find and hopefully forgive his sister for leaving his family. Kate is a girl determined to do right by her mother and track down the father she has never met. And Jesse, while watching his mom try to make ends meet, feels that if this is the end, he might as well take advantage of it. Follow all three as their journeys cross and intertwine in what is one of our favorite new contemporary sci-fi read wow it sounds pretty pretty cool so it looks like the end of the, the planet is coming and they, they all kind of like have to deal with it with their own ways and so it sounds pretty pretty cool i am excited to read this and then the second book that we got this month is called crier's war and it says one mortal one made one loved and one betrayed this is by nina varela i apologize if it's not how you say that but this is also an exclusive signed edition and of course we do get a letter from the author and this is just extremely extremely 
beautiful. So this one says, it features a world where perfect androids known as Autome have enslaved their human creators. Lady Cryer and Autome and daughter of the Sovereign King is terrified that the people will find out she isn't as perfect as once believed. Ayla Cryer's human handmaiden has been biding her time and plotting revenge on the king for murdering her family. Her plan hidden where it hurts the most and murder Cryer. But once Ayla and Cryer began spending more and more time together, their feelings for one another began to shift. Can Leia and Cryer's relationship survive a world on the brink of war? I'm really, really excited for this. Actually, I absolutely have fallen in love with not only sci-fi books and our space, but sci-fi books that feature androids and like humanoids. And I think that's just so cool. So I'm really, really excited to read this book. It sounds so, so good. And there you go, guys. That is the Owlcrate box for the month of October. I pretty much love everything, especially the necklace. The necklace is definitely my favorite thing in the box. If you're interested in subscribing to Owlcrate, I'll let you know what the, the theme for the month of November is. And the theme for the November box is Through the Enchanted Forest. And so it says every November box will include an exclusive reading planner in collaboration with Blue Star Press. Ooh, so we get another reading planner. They've been including one in every box for the past. This will be the third year because I've gotten two other reading planners for Owl Crates. So I'm excited that we're getting another one. I can't wait to see it. I really loved the other two that we've gotten because they're so pretty and I like that they're including one every single year. Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. All of my social medias are linked down below including Twitter, Instagram, and Goodreads if you'd like to follow me on those platforms. I hope to see you guys on my next video. Have a good day guys and keep reading. Bye!